Well, it is finally here. The gates at the State Fair of Texas officially opened an hour ago. We have live team coverage. Annalise Parks has the forecast for the fair in just a moment. But first, we're going to get straight to Yona Gavino, who is there at the fair. Yona, take it away. Russ, I have been here all morning and the excitement has just been growing. I've actually talked to several people, including a group of four sisters who've been coming here for years. Some of them even flew in for an annual tradition. It's a celebration of all things Texas, and there's plenty to see and do for everyone. Fletcher's corny dogs, all the buildings, games, and the people. Over 7,500 students take part in livestock exhibitions and contests. These llamas just arrived. Senior Vice President of Operations Rusty Fitzgerald gave us a tour of the 70 plus games on the Midway. We try, try to change things up every year so there's something fresh and new. But, uh, you know, the, my big enjoyment is seeing happy families come out here and people having a good time and laughing and playing. Break a plate and basketball are popular games. The more you win, the bigger your prize. If you look for our all kids win signs out there, they can come play the game. We'll make them win. They will win a, a nice size prize on there so they can have a really good time. These sisters say the excitement on opening day is hard to beat. It was a convenient time, and my sister Cindy, she lives in Phoenix now, so two of us came from out of state to be here. With all that's happening at the state fair, it can be easy to overlook something. This new Ferris wheel offers a view of the Dallas skyline and all the activities below. It's the biggest, best state fair in the United States. And it wouldn't be an authentic experience without deep fried over the top concoctions. Everyone needs to get up right now, come out to state fair and get a corny dog. It's the best. And the state fair runs through October 21st. Russ, back to you.